guys, it's Fishel here, and welcome back to the 15th episode of the Pokemon Omega Ruby Wonderlock. In the last episode, for those of you who have not checked it out, go check it out because it was, of course, a very, very good episode. Because every single episode I even record is a very, very good episode. And I kind of, um, I'm just kind of messing around with my microphone real quick. So, the question of the day is actually going to be, uh, do you like the way that my microphone is sounding right now? Like, in my opinion, it sounds a lot more cleaner, a lot nicer in my opinion. But I'm actually kind of curious, what do you guys think about the, uh, the new audio? I'm actually really, really curious, because I like it better, but again, I'm not making these videos for myself. I'm making it for you guys, so let me know down below whether or not you think that you like this new, uh, this new way that I sound, basically, that's what I'm gonna say, because I think it sounds much, much cleaner, and I saw a garbage can over there. It's empty. Darn it! Why is there never anything in the garbage can? Like, there is literally never, ever anything in the garbage can. I, I never get why. I never get why. Anyways, real quick, my phone is going off. Stop that phone. Stop that right now. I don't like you going off. Anyways, the cable car is ready to depart. Would you like to board it? No, I, I'm, I'm, I would not want to. Why would I be asking you right now to get on if you're just like, yeah, I'm standing in front of the car right now and I don't really know if you want to get on or not. So, um, let me know. Yeah, and actually fun thing, a while back, like right when I was actually starting to do YouTube, a person made an Omega Ruby Wonderlock, uh, not Wonderlock, it was Omega Ruby layout. I know that for sure. And he used that little scene with like the freight cart moving up and do that layout looked so sick. He vectored it so nicely. Like if you guys think that my vectoring is good, like you guys have not seen anything. My vectoring is not that good. I try, but it really is not that good. And this guy, he did such a good job. Like he actually made it look so nice. But then he, um, he hasn't really been doing it since. So that kind of makes me a little sad. It makes me a little sad. Meteorites pack amazing power. Really now, do they? Team Magma wants to expand the land mass. How's that for insane? I love how you just want to increase the water mass though. So you're kind of insane too. I, I wouldn't just be blaming on one person, but oh no, Team Magma outnumbers us. We can't keep up with them. Are you sure about that? That annoying Team Aqua. They always mess up with our plans. Or mess up. Yeah, mess with the uh, mess with our plans. That's what he was saying. Okay. All right. Anyways, that was Archie. Oh, get out my blasted way, ye scurvy team magma knaves, or face a killing. Wow. Okay then. Hey there, Archie. Do you want do you want to talk real quick? Confound the lot of you. Let me through, you bilgrats. No. Nope. Go, stomp Team Aqua, and expand the land. Stay out of our way, okay? We're trying to enlarge the landmass for the good of everyone. The energy contained within Mount Chimney and the power of the meteorite. We and Team Magma are gonna get it all for ourselves. Whoa! <laughs> really now? Are you actually? So this is gonna be a battle right now. Who do I want in the front? I don't want Melodic in the front because you are pretty high level at the moment. I'm actually gonna send in Mighty Yenna. I have a feeling you're gonna actually. Ooh, you're gonna have a Poochyana. I know you are. I'm gonna send out Curly because you can go for a disarming voice most likely. So. Let's see how this goes. We of Team Magma are working hard for everyone's sake. Like, if there's more land, there'd be more places for uh, for you to live. Everyone would be happy. Are you sure? Are you sure? Because, like, sure there might be more land for people to live on, yeah, but then I also feel like some people are going to want to take up more land. So, it's like, it's not actually going to be more land, because people would just take up more land. If you get what I'm saying by that. And, whoa, I just realized... This actually looks really grainy, like, the ground on this, like, stage, I'm gonna say, looks really, really grainy for some reason, I don't know why. But I'm gonna go for a disarming voice, that should do a ton of damage to Poochyanda. It actually one-shots it! Okay, then! Was not expecting that, I was expecting it to, like, do, like, three quarters, but not one-shot. A coughing's gonna be next, I'm gonna stay in, because I can always go for a, a confusion. And that is, like, you should be faster than a, a coughing, so this should one-shot it as well. And it does not. You're gonna have to That's gonna hurt. Alright. That did a lot of damage, but it didn't kill, so that's good. I'm gonna go for the confusion, and this coughing is now down! So there we go. Coughing is now down. And 
I think that's it for the battle. Curlia, though, is gonna level up to level 23. The plus two on the HP and plus two on the special attack. That is pretty nice. A draining Kiss. I actually like that a lot. I like that better than Heal Pulse. I actually do, because Heal Pulse, you can't really heal yourself up. You can only heal up other people. So, I feel like that's a better move, so. Let's go ahead and get rid of Healing Pulse and just learn Draining Kiss, because Draining Kiss is a very, very good recovery move, in my opinion. Huh? What do you mean I lost? I mean, like, you don't have any more Pokemon left, so I kind of won that battle. That's what I mean by it. Anyways, if I recall correctly, there should be a TM down this way, right? There is, and it's Incinerate. We can actually... Ooh, do we want to teach that to Monferno? Do we want to teach that to Monferno or not? That is the question right now. That is the true, true question right now. So, how much power are you? You're 60 power. I mean, it burns the berry. That part is not really too useful. But, you know... Wait, Mayana can learn it? Say what? Say what? Was not expecting that at all. I did not even know he could learn it. But, learn something new every day, apparently, you know? was not expecting to see that. For now, I'm going to kind of leave that up to you, um, like, to you guys. If you guys want me to go ahead and... No, I don't want to say it right now. If you guys want me to, um... Teach him on Inferno, go ahead. Comment down below. Let me know. Hey, I want I want to see it. Use it. Because, yeah, good reasons and stuffs. But, uh, for now, I'll just leave it up to you guys. Because I don't really know if I want to teach it or not. I probably... It probably would be smart. Because what's your best? I think you're more especially... I think, or special attacking. You uh, you do have a higher special attack slightly though. Like very, very slightly. You have lowered attack though. So flame wheel is attack. You have ember. So it might be a good decision to actually teach it to him. I don't really know for certain though. I feel like it would be more beneficial for us to teach him. But anyways, let's go talk to this guy. I always forget your name. What's your name again? <laughs> it's you! You're the one who tried to interrupt me! Tabitha! That's your name! That's your name! Okay, I forgot your name. I'm sorry, but I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But, you know, you just talk so slow that I, I just can't realize. A meteor falls! D -d 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 Do you intend to get in my way once more? Ugh! You're really, 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 an obnoxious child, aren't you? <laughs> that was a great. That was actually great. Uh, I will crush you, so you will never get in my way again. Well, that just took a turn for the bad. That was actually a little kind of creepy there. Like, that was actually a little creepy. You're gonna send out coughing again. Not a big deal because I can always go for the confusion. You're gonna be level 24 though. That's a little scary. That's a little scary. I should be able to live it though. Oh no, 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 curly, curly. Oh. Oh, he was faster. He was faster. No. Oh. That's two deaths now. That's two deaths we have. Oh my gosh, wow. Wow! I can't believe that. I can't believe that just happened. Oh, I cannot believe that. That annoys me. That really annoys me. I'm gonna go out into Melodic because, like, Melodic can eat this up no matter what. Oh, that that really annoys me. Self destruct. He was faster. He was faster. Oh, why couldn't you have gone for like a sludge? I think I could have lived a sludge too. I really do. Oh, that's so frustrating. I'm annoyed by that. I'm annoyed by that. I I am I am mad. I'm mad at him and I'm mad at myself because I should have I should have thought of that. I should have thought about that. That was my fault. Like the other one, the other death we had was not my fault. Like I had no option. It was literally I just got trapped and I couldn't do anything. Yet again. <sighs> but like this one was completely, completely my fault. So that that actually is really annoying. I knew you were strong. What a shame, though. That meteorite we got from Professor Whoever is already in our boss's hands. Where's the boss, you might ask? Ah, oh, yes, yes. Right this way. Oh, I do hope that you can be shown to Magma's true power. 
I feel like he's so detached from everything. He's just like, yeah, I don't really care anymore. I really don't even care. Because it's no big deal whatsoever. Anyways, there's the Team Magma music. The power contained in the meteorite. It will mirror the explosive energy contained within the planet's core with the meteorite's power. I remember those eyes and the indomitable will that seemed to burn behind them. Ah, now I recall. You are the one who defied us at Straight Port's Oceanic Museum. And your presence here tells me that you have defeated Tabitha. Yes, I see now that the stirring of interest I felt was not misplaced. Hmm, you show true promise. Fine, I will attempt to educate you. Thousands of years ago, there lived the most powerful being that was said to, ca uh, to be capable of creating new islands on the planet. The power which we seek in Team Magma. This power, which can expand the available melan mass, belongs to a legendary and super ancient Pokemon. Though now it slumbers, having lost the source of its power and being trapped in a deep sleep. So what is it that we must do to awaken this slumbering giant? Our research has led us to Mount Chimney. Yes, here. To his very meteorite. If we create the right conditions, we should find ourselves able to alter this meteorite's qualities. Yes, even into a megastone. Even, a kin even into a keystone. And here, at Mount Chimney. Hmm. I should not say too much. That is the end of today's lesson. Now then, I believe it is time we begin. The time for the purge has come. I do believe that I have made myself quite clear when we first, when we, when we were last in Slayport. I warned you that any fool standing in our way would be met without our mercy. I will bury you by my own hand. I hope you will appreciate this honor. It's an honor now to be buried by your hand? What? Say what? This is new to me. This is extremely new to me. Alright, there's the glasses. I do like how they put the Megastone inside his, uh, ear- like, uh, not earring, uh, glasses. I feel like that's such a cool little thing to do. I don't know why, I just really like that little touch. And we're gonna go into Mighty Anna again. Ooh, that, that's not gonna be a big deal with Melodic. Uh, my only problem right now is that you're level 25. That scares me a little. I'm gonna go for the Water Pulse, because, again, Melodic is one of our strongest. I could go into, uh... What's it called? Uh, Monferno right now, but I'm not going to. I get the confusion though, which is really, really nice. I really like that. You're gonna hit yourself even better. Even better. I'm gonna go for another Water Pulse, just because this way you're down, which is easy, easy experience for us. Milan's gonna eat that up like it's nothing. It's gonna be breakfast for her. For her. It literally is gonna be breakfast. Uh, yeah, it was breakfast. Camera up is next. I need to stay in for um, camera up. Like, there's no option. I need to, because this is... You're level 27. You're level 27. Oh my gosh. This is going to one-shot, though. It's times four effective. There's no way you're living this. I don't care if you're th three levels higher than me or not. You're out of here. You are out of here. And Malak's just going to get 1,400 experience. And that is great. Plus three in the HP. Plus four in the special defense. That is great. That is actually phenomenal. Golbat is next. Uh, going to Mighty Anna, I guess. I don't really have anything better. Yeah, I don't really have anything better for Golbat. I need, I need a good electric type, but I don't have a good electric type. I need to get one, though. I really need to get one. I'm gonna go for an Ice Fang. Uh, that should do a decent amount. You're gonna go for a Confuse Ray. Ugh. What's the accuracy of that? Isn't that accuracy, like, 65% and somehow you land on that? Like, come on. And then I hit myself. Even better! Alright, Ice Fang now. Air Cutter. That's actually gonna do a decent amount. Yeah, did a decent amount. Alright. Don't hit yourself. You do go for the Ice Fang. That should be really, really effective. Just kidding. It's only gonna do half. Well, that's great. That is phenomenal. Thank you so much for that. I'm gonna have to go for some potion now because I, I'm not gonna be able to live another Air Cutter. I'm not gonna be able to. So I need to heal back up. My problem now is I'm going to be stuck in a cycle. You're going to go for another air cutter. And now I even have the chance of flinching. Now that, did, that didn't do half. But if I'm, if I'm confused and I hit myself, my end is dead. And I am not willing to risk that. I'm going to swap out into Furfru because Furfru is the defensive tank we have on our team. The only problem is that Golbat's three levels higher. That's my major, major concern right now. It's three levels higher. Like, that did a lot of damage to Furfru. Like, it's scary right now. I'm actually scared. Headbutt gets you down to red, probably. Yeah, get you down to red. You're gonna go for Confuse Ray again. 
You are really annoying with that confuser, right? You are so, so, so annoying. I'm gonna go for another headbutt just to get you down. Alright, so there we go. Breakthrough. No, okay. Right, you're gonna go for an air cutter. I'm gonna have to go for another potion because I don't. If he gets a crit with a potion, he might be able to kill. I don't know for certain. I'm gonna go for another super potion though, just to be safe because I do not want Furfur to die. Furfur has put in too much work to die. Like, he literally. Oh, she, sorry, has put in way, way, way too much work. So, I'm sorry, Furfru is not dying. You are not dying. I don't care what. You snap out of confusion, that's what I'm talking about. That right there is what I'm talking about. Yes, Furfru, that's what I want to see. 1.275 experience. You're gonna level up to level 23. That's great because we do need more higher level Pokemon on the team. You're gonna get plus 3 on the HP. Plus two on the special attack, plus two on the attack, plus three on the special defense, and plus three on the speed. That's pretty good. It's pretty good money, and is gonna gain a level as well. And we defeated Ma that look on Maxi's face was priceless. That is the thumbnail right now. That is the thumbnail. I don't even care. That is by far the best thumbnail you can possibly have. That look. Oh, you are quite capable. I feel beh I fell behind, but only by an inch. Four grand. Four grand, that's what I'm talking about. I like that. I like getting all that money. I love getting all that money. That is a great feeling. That's a great, great feeling. Oh, so you repulsed the great Maxi in battle. Ha ha, you never failed to entertain me. An excellent start. This time, permit me to release my full strength. Once you've tasted my Pokemon's mega developed power, you will say goodbye to your last shred of hope. Eh, uh, oh, wait, 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 sorry. I, I kind of got a phone call. Um, I'm going to have to go answer that real quick. Uh, just one minute, please. If it is me. Oh, then it is Mount Patter. I understand. I will come at once. Oh, I, um, yeah, sorry about that. I, uh, I had to kind of go ahead and answer a phone call. You know, um, excuse me now. So for such rudeness, man, for reparation, take this meteorite with my apologies. You may do it, or do with it whatever you like. Because we just went through all that work to go ahead and get this meteorite, and now we're just going to throw it back because we don't care about it anymore. It is worthless. And I will not again forget the face of the trainer who managed to thwart me in battle. Oh boy, I'm a marked man. I'm a marked man, guys. Congratulations, you become a marked man. And there we go. Now we have a Scatterway here. Huh. If isn't that little scrimp, the blast of that Maxi, he just escaped us. And he was and he just left behind the meteorite that he's been crazy about finding. Can't be. Could he have found out where the real orbs are hidden? That sneaky little scientific so-and-so. I've always left watching his bony backside running two steps ahead of me. And he just walks off. Alright, see you, Archie. Have a good day. Um, thanks for kind of visiting me. It was, uh, it was nice seeing you. It was, it was really nice seeing you. Now, though, I need to go. I want to get another encounter. I really, really want another encounter. Because now we have another dead Pokemon. We have another. Another one. I don't want another one. I only want a one. And I don't even want that one. I wanted to have zero. We were actually pretty close to having that, too. And then, no! He had to go and die. Jagged Pass, we do get an encounter for this route. Uh. I'm gonna have, I think, Mightyena in the front. Not Mightyena, Monferno in the front. Just only for the fact that you are on the lower side of things, and most of the Pokemon here are going to be fire types. So the encounter for this route is going to be a Spoink. Fun fact about Spoink, I think I mentioned this so many times that it's ridiculous. But, a little fun thing that I always laugh at is that in the Pokedex entry, it always says that if the pearl on its head, if it loses the pearl, it will die. Be it, if anyone recalls, and I think it's like the, uh, the red and blue, like, uh, no, not red and blue, uh, the Explorers of Darkness and, um, the Explorers of Time, mystery, like the Pokemon Mystery Dungeon games, like that, the Spoink actually lost its pearl and came up to the explorers and actually asked them, being like, can you go and get the pearl for me? But yet, in the Pokedex entry, it's saying, if it lost its pearl, it will die. Like, I don't know about you, but that's kind of like messed up, A, because literally it's saying if it loses it, it's going to die, and B, because li that did a lot of damage. Why did I keep Monferno? Oh, no, that's why I kept Monferno in. Like, why am I keeping Monferno in when literally the Spoink is right here and it's super effective against me? And then I realized, oh, yeah, that's because uh, Monferno was the only one that could actually do only a little bit of damage. You're going to go for a Psych Up. That's not terrible because you literally 
copied zero stance changes, so yeah, I don't really have a problem with that. Anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and throw my Pokeball at this boink, and come on now, come on, get caught right now, please, get caught, that's two, there's the third, and click. There we go, that is what I'm talking about. And I'm excited for this new encounter. Please be a good encounter. That's all I want. I just want a good trade. That's really, really all I want. But anyways, real quick, let's go ahead and um, read this Pokedex entry. Spoink, the bounce Pokemon. Spoink bounces around on its tail. The shock of its bouncing makes its heart pump. As a result, this Pokemon cannot afford to stop bouncing. If it stops, its heart will stop as well. So there we go. Do I want to give a nickname to this boy? Yes, of course. I'm going to go ahead and nickname you Fish Nerd Wender Muck. So there we go. Press the enter button. And we can now go ahead and wonder trade a Pokemon away. This is great. I really, really. Give me a solid Pokemon, please. Please, just give me a solid Pokemon and don't give me dupes. Because dupes are just a, like plain annoying because you have to then go ahead, retrade again, and no one likes it, basically. In short, no one likes it. So, when I just get Spoink, that's right. You know, you have thick fat and everything else, so you know, it's not terrible. You know, it's level 19, it's not, it's not a Wurple, so you can't really argue. It's not a Wurple. You know, hopefully the person out there enjoys this Spoink because, you know, I don't know. Uh, it, it was in the one lock. Hopefully that's why they enjoy it. I have no clue. I have really no clue what I'm talking about right now. But who am I going to find? I'm going to find Tanise from Anguilla saying, nice to meet you. That's typically not a good sign. Oh boy. Because typically when they say nice to meet you, it means that they're like still new to the game. So I'm really hoping that's not true. But you can give me a magic card. I need to re wonder trade that away again. Oh, I didn't want to do that. I didn't want to be one to train a Pokemon. Come on, I didn't want to do that. I really did not want to, but now I need to, because literally I have no option. Like, I already have a Magikarp. It's alive, I can still use this. There literally is no point in me keeping it if I decided to keep it. So I'm not going to. We have to one to trade it away again. And, you know, can you give me something good in the meantime? That's really what I'm asking for right now. I'm asking for something good. Uh, I think it was this one. I think it was this one. So I'm gonna go ahead, I wanna trade this one away, and you know, just give me something good. Please, an electric type would be solid, a grass type would be solid, a fairy type would be pretty solid as well, because now we just killed our fairy type, so you know, that's always great. We kinda need to fill up that gap now. Uh, I'm gonna find Claire from the United States. Hola a todos. I think that's Spanish, but I have no clue, and uh, I, I don't know what to respond to that. But anyways, let's go ahead and send this Magikarp away, and we're going to be getting a Ghastly. That's not bad. That's not bad. I, I really cannot complain, especially if you have egg moves. Ooh, that'd be nice. If you had, and it's Japanese, so I'm really hoping it has egg moves. That'd be really nice if it did have egg moves. It would really make my day if it did. And we just got to go check real quick because... I want to check right now because if we have to, if it's too high level, we're gonna have to, of course, want to trade it away. I doubt it is high level though, because it's a Gengar, well, not Gengar. Um, it's a Ghastly. You have Lick, Clear Smog, Disable, and Perish Song. Perish Song is not ideal. Let's just say that. And actually, I might as well put Bagel on the team now. Might as well, because Curly is not doing much. Oh, I feel Bebe as well. I could put, I could put for Bebe. I could do that. You know, I'm gonna have to make like a kind of like a big. Um, I'm gonna have to do a. No, no! I just realized something. I need to do a grinding montage. No, I don't want to do a grinding montage. No, that's like the worst part, in my opinion, about um, doing Nuzlocke. Is the fact that you have to grind. A lot of people want to see you grind on screen because they don't like trust you, basically. And I don't know why you guys don't trust me, like. I do not know why, because I'm typically very, very, uh, trustworthy. Like, all my friends say I'm trustworthy. So, I don't know why you guys don't. But, you know, I have to record the grinding montage for you guys. So, that's my only really, like, big, big downfall to, like, recording those locks. It's the fact that everyone's like, record the grinding montage, and it's time-consuming. It really is time-consuming. And I just, like, typically you could go ahead and, um... That you wanted to go ahead and you want a car trip and you wanted to grind, which is the perfect time to actually grind during a car trip. 
and you can't do that then because you need to literally record and my laptop cannot handle it so you can't record then this place isn't your casual hike it's not even suited for a picnic yeah it's not it's, it's up in the mountains it's it's called Jagged Path for a reason. You're gonna send out Gloom, which is actually perfect because I do have my Monferno out, so... Go for a Flame Charge, and this should go down probably within two hits. But now, Gloom right there is level 22. You're level 22, but yet, Archie had like level 25s. So like, I don't get it. That actually did more than I was expecting. You're new for a stun spore. Wow. Wow, man. You're, you're gonna go for that move. I... Psh. You're gonna go for Mega Drain then, as well. I'm disappointed in you. I am disappointed in you. I was expecting you to go for a different move, and you just... You just didn't. Anyways, I'm gonna go for the flame wheel. You're dead. Just die. There we go. You're dead. Uh, that's all that matters. You're, it's the fact that you're dead. Monferno's gonna level up to level 24, though. Pretty solid. Pretty solid. You get plus three in the HP. I can't complain. You're gonna send out Swab Blue next. Now's where I really wish I had... Curlia! Really wish I had you, but I don't. Probably gonna go out on the Mighty Anna for you. I actually no. Yeah, Mighty Anna I think is my best option because you are not weak to uh, poison in any way, shape, or form. So, oh, it's sweet. That's not the Pokemon I was thinking of. I can go for Ice Fang though. And this thing is dead. So I don't think you're dragging yet. But it's still that did not one shot. What? I was expecting that to one shot. I was really expecting that. To, I was like, yeah, that's gonna one shot. What? I literally was so surprised there. I was like, there's no way that did not one shot. And then it just didn't one shot. I'm like, what? What is this? What is this black magic you have there? It was $352. That's not great. Come on. Come on. I was expecting more. I was expecting more. Route 112. We already got an account here. Uh, there is a town, though. And so, real quick, we do need to go ahead and, you know. Go into the box, organize the box, go to box, go to the box with Garatina. I'm sorry, Curlia, but you have died. You must go in this box. So, you know, let me guys, uh, let me know down below who you want to have on the team. Like, I'm thinking right now, this is just me thinking out loud. I'm thinking of having Bagon definitely on the team. So for now, I'm, this might change. I'm just going to put it on the team just for now. I'm not going to edit the layout or anything like that. I'm just putting on the layout so I can kind of plan, see what I am thinking, basically. So I'm thinking about having you right there. We would have a fire type. We would have a fighting type. War type's already out of the question. Fairy type might be nice, but, uh, nah. I think a ground type would be better because I know. I think the ghastly is better. I'm gonna put that on. This is what I have for the team so far. If you guys agree with me, let me know down below saying, yeah, that seems like a good team so far. I'm not gonna do anything more. I'm literally just gonna end off the episode here. But, you know, let me know down below what you think. Do you want me to stick with this team, grind it up on, in the next episode, or do you want me to uh, basically change up the team a little more and pull a Pokemon that you think are better on the team? But anyways, guys, and thank you all for watching this video. It really, really means a lot to me. And be sure to burn the like button down below if you have enjoyed the episode so far. Or hit the subscribe button if you're new to my channel and you want to see more. But anyways, guys, I will see you all later. Have a good day and goodbye.